yourself to work daily, you're not alone. In Nashville, a whopping 84% of people who work downtown drive their car every day. And as News Channel 5's Kyle Horan learned, there's a push to reduce that number and get people to work in other ways. Four wheels, two small wheels, or maybe just your own two feet. There are many ways to get around Music City, but there's one way that city planning officials want to reduce. We're actually asking people to just take one new commute option during that one week. Single driver commuters. Nashville is a car culture. Everybody loves their cars. Miranda Clements is one of the people behind the plan. We've had a lot of people say, oh, you know, I'm really excited. I'm going to try the bus. She and others at the Metro Nashville Planning Department have taken it upon themselves to try to manage the number of cars in the roadway. The way they want to reduce that is the Nashville connector. Everybody knows that traffic is getting worse, and as I think the population's projected to increase by a million in the next 25 years, traffic's just going to get worse. So yes, we have had a lot of interest. The focus is to get businesses in the city to encourage their employees to not drive alone. Trying to get on this side from the other side of the river, it's, uh, it's a bit of a challenge. One such company already doing that is Barge Design Solutions. I live in East Nashville. Um, we'll typically kind of go down Riverside. They got nice bike lanes there. And to their employees, they offer this fancy bike rack. Use it as a way to get to work and then also use a way to get a little bit of exercise. Something software designer Justin Graham takes advantage of regularly. I can almost bike here as fast as I can drive here in some, in some, on some days, depending on what it is like getting across the river over there. Our culture is really about making the healthy choice, the, the easy choice. Graham and his boss, CEO Robert Higgins. And one of the very first projects I worked at at Barge was the stadium. See value in alternative forms of transportation. We have employees that ride their bike to work, they take the Music City Star, they take the train in, they'll uh, bring a scooter in. We have all those different things happening here. And the business plans to be on board with Nashville Connectors Commuter Challenge from October 22nd to October 28th. We're asking people to try one different option other than driving alone. Kyle Horan, News Channel 5. Thanks, Kyle. Clement says she believes the number of workers in downtown Nashville could increase by as much as 40,000 people if 72 projected new developments become a reality. There will soon